No, uh, I don't know if you know the story about how it became legal about 60 years, 70 years ago. Uh, it was a Danish uh, carpenter uh, who didn't succeed in his uh, normal work, so he started to invent uh, toys. In the first place, he invented toys in, in wood. Later on, his son, he started uh, to try to figure out about how to do something in plastic. And then he invented this small brick, the first, uh, so the birth, so to say, of Lego. And I can't remember how long it is ago, but I think it was in the beginning of the 50s or something. What I know and what I remember, that was, uh, I think about 52 years ago, I got my first box uh, of Lego. And that was a small, tiny box. And I could build a small house like this and this and this. And it was amazing to have this in your, your hands. So what I can say is, have you got once a Lego brick in your hand, you'll always remember how fantastic the invention actually is. And uh, I played with Lego until, yes, I, I was 20 or 25 or something like that. And then later on, uh, my son, he took over. And uh, I, I don't know how many packages of Lego I gave him for, for Christmas. But the best of it was actually, I think in the first place for me, because then I have the excuse that I could play with Lego once again. So then I got 20 years or more with Lego. And now I can just say that uh, I'm waiting for my grandchildren to start playing Lego as well. They are now three and one year old, so we can start with Duplo and then we can uh, go on with uh, the real Lego later on and then I can get 20 years more. So uh, that, was, that is so to say more, more or less a whole life that you are going to, to have together with Lego. And all these inventions. And, uh, now we, uh, we have the latest here with the, the mind storms, but when you could be uh, as a creative by having this small box in the in the late 80 and uh, the late 50s, and now you need this one, what about uh, the next 50 years? What are you going to have in your hands in 50 years' time? I don't know. You don't know. We don't know. But I, uh, none of us know. But I think that there will come something new. They will come with new inventions. It will be real robots. I don't know what. So I just uh, think that we have to look forward. Uh, into the future to see what they can create for us and uh, at the same time I think you're going to have a, a good day here uh, playing a little bit with the Mindstorms, be creative and I can see that they have uh, some quite good things up there that one can uh, learn from e even there so it could be used in schools and so on so uh, a fantastic toy that can be used in a, a lot of places so I can just say to you have a nice day